any questions? No, okay, then. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys have done the impossible. What's that? That which has never been done before. 25 years before the microphone, man and boy, I'm known as a man with an indestructible voice. I have played Coast Commander and lived. Three days of Metro, it's destroyed. <laughs> <laughs> Morning, everybody. Morning. Morning. That was good. <laughs> <laughs> the person was out of safe, though, so we get to go again. Okay, in three, two, one. Morning, everybody. Morning. There's always one. There's always. Dash is hot. It's Welcome to Florida. Florida. Yeah, it's because he's here. Yeah. It's because yeah. you're it's here. Because you're here. Yeah. Who said that? I love you. <laughs> oh man. I'm coming up with a uh -oh. Not to mention, I think I'm allergic to water and heat. It's like eyes puffy, can't see. <laughs> Welcome to Scott Bitching 101. <laughs> I like this. Turn up the air conditioning. My makeup is melting. <laughs> Can you hear me in the back? No. No. Deny. <laughs> Perjury. All right, I'll use this. Ha! <laughs> really? Hey, there. All right. Solve that problem. <laughs> I was just want to use one of these things. <laughs> See how it works. <laughs> <laughs> So I'm going to do the entire panel as a mind piece today. I don't think you could do that. <laughs> and the room clears out. No. Oh you were talking too much, Sky. <laughs> I'm in a box. <laughs> no, you're in a I'm box. walking into the wind here. You're not in a box, Scott. You're in a Hi, jar. welcome to our Sunday meeting. Come on in. Come <laughs> greet our new brother. Good morning. Welcome to our cult. <laughs> That's great. Today is Children's Day up on the third floor. So today is what we like to call Tender Meat Cannibalism Day. <laughs> it's going to be awesome, and I hope you brought your appetites. <laughs> I know I did. <laughs> Human flesh, the other, other, other white people. <laughs> so how is everybody? We did that already, didn't we? Yeah. yeah. Okay, my brain is mush. Oh, okay, we all. Mush. You know what I want to get in a little yeah, tiny hat? I want to get like a little tiny cowboy hat. <laughs> <laughs> cowboy Lolita. They can make you one like this and then have a little cowboy hat on top of it. That'd be awesome. We wanted to braid your hair yesterday. Really? Yeah. I haven't had my hair braided in ages. Oh. I like to have my hair braided. You should just go and do it. I don't, as you may have noticed. It's the one thing I forgot to pack. See, and I'll be like, Dude, not even take the hat off, except I'm already soaked, sweaty, and hat head 101. <laughs> so, welcome to Stumping <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's it. Now you know. you know. It's like, he's not bald! <laughs> I thought the hair was sewn into the hat. I'm actually not Scott McNeil, I'm a Scott McNeil cosplayer. <laughs> Seriously, I got this whole thing in the dealer's room, it's a onesie. <laughs> what a twist. How much I you believe it? It's a footy too. <laughs> 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 That's why I'm uncomfortable, I'm sitting on my own foot. <laughs> yeah, that would do it. Go Wolverine on it and just flip it. Frickin' right, so I'll go Wolverine. Like, give me yeah. a couple of Ryan Coke, I'll frickin' pound this thing right now. <laughs> Uh, so as usual, I brought you here. To, I got stuck between two, two different bits there, and my head went boop. <laughs> suppose you're wondering why I brought you over here. Yeah. Because you're misfits, you're rogues, you're mutants. <laughs> you don't fit in. I intend to take you and forge you into the most cohesive, dangerous, lethal fighting force that has ever been assembled. It's going <coughs> to be tough. It's going to be a hard fight. Not all of us are going to survive. Yes, there will be cannibalism. But if you the proud, the brave, that are left, we will be the Otak army. God bless Wolverine. Everyone. Wolverine. So if anyone has questions, 
I would love you because otherwise I'm going to sit up here and roll around and ramble like I could have been. Not that we can learn. Oh, what do you think? I am the poet. And then podium. You know, this is the only place in the world where it's like I'm still wet from the shower, but I'm also soaked with sweat. <laughs> Again, Florida. Florida. Yes. Will you marry us? Okay. No. All, <laughs> All of us. Now let's define this. <laughs> the syntax is important here. Will I, as an ordained minister, marry you no. to each other? Or will no, I, you marry both of us. As me We're having the best day here. of my life, marry you two yes. as my beloved brides. Yes, yes. I will. <laughs> Could, could you all just turn your backs for, you know, some time? No, it's not as a neuro. I mean, yes, I will marry. Okay. Chicken man? Chicken man. Uh, yeah. Can you say in Voltar's voice, I am evil, stop laughing? <laughs> Remember that whole bit where I said I came in and my voice was blown? <laughs> 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 That's a no. <laughs> no, it's never enough. <laughs> never enough. I will do anything for you, except sun or you did the Twinkie thing yesterday. Which is on I camera. I the Twinkie! <laughs> 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 I'm evil, so shut up! Hey, Steve! I don't care! Sugar! <laughs> 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 oh, that was really good. Hi, we're back. Welcome back to the show. We just took a temporary break in the action. Yes. Yes. I hate pointing, but it's. Because, I mean, you know, just in cartoons I've done, I honestly figure over 12,000 episodes of various things. And they're all for, like, I've never had a day where you go like, oh, i got to go slave away in front of a hot microphone for a couple of hours and get a big bucket of money in the end of it. <laughs> Stuff's heavy, you know. Give me your favorite character. This one, I mean, Voltar was a ton of fun. Thank you for being, you know, I don't know how many people watch that down here. Because they let us be creative maniacs on that show. It was myself, the Tokar, Colin Murdoch, and then the, the multi, multi psychotic, brilliant Tabitha St. Germain. Mm -hmm. oh, she's and, awesome. I mean, we spent a lot of time just rolling on the floor. You're like, we can't, we stop it. It's like, I want to stop. The laughing hurts. <laughs> show me and the dolly where he made you laugh. <laughs> Uh, all the Beast Wars stuff was fun. You know, a lot of the stuff I've said before, too. I mean, I'm still going, yeah, yeah I got to be Ruby the Elf. <laughs> <laughs> Play Wolverine was cathartic. Because I just got to break everything. <laughs> I told you guys my fart story, didn't I? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> um, I don't know, on camera. I, I just did that episode of Psych, and that was a lot of fun, because I got, you know, I got horribly maimed, mangled, mutilated, and brutally murdered by three comedy legends. Christopher Lloyd, Garrett Morris, and Martin Mull. I'm just going like, That episode. <laughs> and what you're not allowed to do is go up and Christopher Lloyd! <laughs> you know, I'm gonna pick family of those sisters. He is intense. He is a scary, intense man. Waiting for camera to roll. We're just looking at each other. I'm like, if you don't roll that camera, he's going to make my head explode like a scare. They're all fun. The weirder ones are the funnest for me. Like, they're really strange. I do a lot of stuff, and not only a lot of people, I don't even know if you've seen, but I kind of get to Frank Welker a lot. Yeah. As in, a lot of times I am paid to not talk, but I am paid to convey. The, Oh, look who shows up! 
Both sing in, you don't call, you don't write, we're all right. Everybody stare and point. I did a show called Sushi Pack. Did anybody ever teach Sushi Pack? That's all I did for like the whole series. Do I have a Oh, Whose panel is this? It's got his Whose panel, Mr. Fancy Cowboy Hat? Oh, wait, maybe it's yours. <laughs> I told you I wasn't the real Scott McNeil. <laughs> I got the and Scott McNeil before me. <laughs> and the original Scott McNeil was retired and living like a king in Patagonia. <laughs> the Dread Pirate Scott. Just got the best idea. <laughs> no good's gonna come of this. What is it? Yeah, there's a pirate ship right outside. Oh, no. You too? Yes. Yeah. Uh, on the side, the I fear there could be piracy going on today. <laughs> Soon, I'll we'll take the entire western seaboard. Rest Eastern. <clears throat> You know what? <laughs> Smarty pants. <laughs> Here is the state of Florida. Yes, it is an eastern seaboard. However, we in Tampa are facing the west of the Gulf, which means the western seaboard. <laughs> <laughs> I'm from Canada, and that's how it works. <laughs> <laughs> we have metric time now. It's weird. It's an hour days, under an hour minutes. So, I mean, yeah. Give me that's what I do. I've played men, women, children, all sorts. It's just, it's, it's, I have the dumbest, greatest job. <laughs> yes, because your shirt's on fire. <laughs> this actually, I've become on the back. Your shirt is on fire. <laughs> Holy oh, crap! <laughs> all right, so we were kind of doing some research right beforehand, and we saw that you did Hacker of League of Legends. Yes. Did you do any other characters for that? I did a whole bunch of characters on League. I, I work on it quite regularly. Oh. I can't remember who. When you did the Voltar for the, the quote he asked you for at the beginning, that was a quote from a League character. Oh, okay. From Viger. I had a feeling. I, I was just like, I don't know. You're going to ask me to say something. I'm going to have no idea why I'm saying it. It was an extremely similar voice. And also, <coughs> something, just another comment. I was sitting up here doing security at the beginning, and my name's also Scott. So everyone's talking about Scott, and we go, oh, oh. Yeah. No. They love me. They love me. I heard somebody say that, and I was like, wait, is he here? Hold it, Bob. That would have been Pressurized cheese adds up to. I'm like, I'm gonna do a little shot of cheese and start. We might have bats. And all censorship boards were on in my head saying, Don't make me all the joke. It's too late. I just did in my head. Those out there, you knew. It's a bird. 